Bill Russell, my favorite NBA player of all time, has finally accepted his ring from the Basketball Hall of Fame. It's taken only 44 years. Despite 11 championships in 13 years, Russell didn't want to become the first black player inducted into the Hall of Fame. He felt there was somebody else more deserving. That is so typical of Bill Russell. Someone wrote the Boston Celtics had to retire his jersey multiple times because the ultimate team player refused to show up. The word is Martin Luther King invited Bill Russell to stand on the stage during his iconic I Have a Dream speech. But Russell, a star in the civil rights movement, refused his place because he felt others deserved it even more. On Friday, Bill Russell finally accepted his Hall of Fame ring, and that's only because the National Basketball Association decided to enshrine a guy by the name of Chuck Cooper into the Hall of Fame. Cooper was the first African-American uh, player drafted into the NBA, and that was in 1950. He was selected by the Celtics. He was a Navy veteran, a star at Duquesne University. His dad was a mailman, his mom a school teacher. He died in 1984. Bill Russell, now 85 years old, but he wanted us to know about Chuck Cooper, and he wanted Chuck Cooper to go in first. Thank you, Bill Russell.